Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and this is Lumber Tycoon 2, Halloween edition. So, um, I've already recorded one episode trying to, like, showcase and display some things that were going on, and it was not good. Um, in fact, uh, I'm probably going to post it just as an example as to show you guys what happens a lot of the times with my recordings and um, it's already like super late so I'm gonna probably make this a shorter video than normal um, so I will post that other video just to just to show and just to be like here this is this is what happens um, I'm not angry I'm not mad and I'm not upset um, I'm a little annoyed but it happens okay so I, I don't want you guys to think that it's like, oh no, code's upset. No, it's it just happens. Um, so I, I wanted to kind of explain that first. So here we are, Lumber Tycoon 2, and we're inside the Woods R Us store, and it is the, uh, the update. This only happens one time a year, October 31st. So today is October 31st. You're watching this November 1st. So the video recorded prior, releases the next day. That's why I've got it, and... If you didn't go get your end times X, it's too late. If you're watching this right now, it's too late. The, the end times X is already put away. But I'm going to show you how to go get it anyway. That way you can be prepared for next year. Okay, first things first, there are a couple of codes here. All right, C-16. From one I can figure out, this is a Caesar, uh, Caesar Cipher 16, or minus 16 from whatever it was. Um, by the way, huge shout out to Bunny Films for showcasing this and to Mummy who showcased it. So both of you guys did an awesome job. Here's the next code. It says co slash Lin or colon or Colin. It could be any of these. Um, we don't know yet. One of my theories was what if it's cosine divided by length? Um, the other theory that I had was what if it's um, like colon and a slash? So it's, it's that face like hmm kind of face um, and the other thing is if you use um, cipher or sorry Caesar cipher 16 or minus 16 it becomes my slash box sorry planes flying overhead here um, in lumber so um, that is kind of my theories on this there are there's one other clue thingy and we haven't figured it out I've asked around I've seen how many people know what's going on and I'm lost I think the C16 is on the right track because um, defaultio Josh likes to use encryption um, if you ever watched his um, his video he posted a QR code that led to a YouTube video and the YouTube video was basically him pulling out a thousand dollars and hiding it on campus of his school that he's in. Uh, I'm gonna go get the end times X, but I'm just talking at the moment. During that um, that egg hunt for a thousand dollars, there were hidden messages throughout the entire video. Um, those messages led to images and led to um, like different geographical locations on campus. Um, no, I wasn't able to go to the campus itself. I used Google Maps to like pinpoint where each one of these locations was. And then um, there was a sound file. And you had to use Statography, which is stereo decryption. And, or it's sound, sound decryption that turned it into images at specific locations, which eventually led to like a whole bunch of other things. So he's all about encryption and puzzles and Stuff. So, oh, did that blow up? The other thing I'm, I'm going to try and do is, I'm in a private server, so I know there's no spook trees, but I would still hunt for one. So, uh, And I also want to go see the different areas, like the ice biome. I want to go up there to see what it looks like. One, two, three. There we go. By the way, it's it's very spooky without sound. Like it just it sounds it doesn't feel re real. It feels very different. Almost had it. Three. There we go. And jump down here. Oh, there it is. So 
Um, the rookie axe normally is what appears when you're down here, but on Halloween, if you place the broccoli, the worms, and the light bulb, sorry, <laughs> the sand, the can of gummy worms, and the, the light bulb, or the broccoli, uh, the beans, uh, the broccoli, the worms, and the ice cream, then you get this. Yay! Yay, it's the end times axe! I don't have to deal with the chicken axe anymore! Burp, 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 burp. Just kidding. So if you grab this before it has a chance to finish, you'll get the floating axe effect. Now, from what I can tell... Okay, can I jump on this? Yeah. Oh, darn. Well, the glowy effect's gone. Anyhow, I did a video over like that effect and the different things that you could do to play with it and stuff like that. It was pretty cool. Huge shout out to Grammy and to, um, oh gosh, who's the other person? They were playing, it, playing with it one night and they were literally like tossing it all over the place. So let's head up to the ice biome. Now that you know how to get your end times axe, glorious, glorious, wonderful end times axe. Oh, by the way, I was asked, um, somebody said that this end times axe is different than the other one. Um, it may have been a texture glitch or something like that because that same person said that it, it didn't change after, like, it's now the same. So, whatever axe you had seen, uh, I wish you had taken a picture of it. Oh. But anywho, I digress. Drive, 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 drive. Um, where should I leave my car? Where should I? Ooh. Okay, I might toss toss my car down. Hmm. Yeah, why not? Jump! Goodbye, car! It should come out the other end. Hopefully. Hopefully it goes flying down there. Okay. So the reason I wanted to get rid of the car is because I can't take it up this little ramp right here, but I do need a car to get back, so hopefully that worked. If not, this is going to be an extremely long video. <laughs> and if this is your first time joining me, um, just so you know, I don't edit. I used to edit, and I don't anymore, so you can basically see everything that I have to go through to do the things that I do. That way you know it's not like just copy and paste and, oh look, I built a house in an hour. No, it takes a really long time. <laughs> Plus if there's any like glitches or funny things that happen along the way, I mean you see them in real time. So. Although, seeing bunny films fly up in the air like four or five times, that was that was pretty comical. Sorry, bunny. I, I thought it was funny. Especially when he like drives over a little hump, then all of a sudden, <laughs> he's like in outer space. Ding, 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 ding. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, we need to go look at the lighthouse, too. Somebody said to go check out the lighthouse. Because it's rusted in any way. So, is it going to be not rusted and fixed? <laughs> like the reverse of what it is? Uh, all the metal textures um, around here now have like rust and corrosion on them. Okay, not much difference here. <laughs> Just ice wood. No spook. Wonder what's up on top of that. Should I? I think I've been over the top of this before. Oh, oh, oh! I didn't mean to jump down all of a sudden. Oh well. Man, I can't see anything. It's just so spooky. Hello. Thank you for the subscribe. BTS Vinmin Cook. <laughs> 
So while it's got the fog going on, you do have like a bit of a night vision. It kind of looks like a flashlight thing going on. Like I didn't need any filters for this. Okay, this is still all rusted. All rusted and broken down. So nothing new there. Oh, oh come on up to the side. There you go. The lighthouse is still broke. Man, those airplanes are just going crazy. Excuse me a second. Oh. There we go. Let's go. Jumpy jump, 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 jump. It's almost calming or relaxing to uh, to have no sound. Also, why are why are these angled? Like, what's the point of the angle right here? Hmm. Hmm. Hold on. That looks very suspicious. <clears throat> Probably nothing, but we need to look anyway. Oh gosh. Can't see through it. Can't tell if it's like a cave entrance or something, or what's going on. Hmm. I wonder if I can glitch through it. No, that didn't work. It's not a thin, thin outward angle, so. Alright, probably nothing. Let's keep going. Look around for spookwood. Yeah. Oh! Hey, there's the tunnel. Sweet. We just dropped down through the tunnel. Eee. Oh, my truck didn't go all the way. But I landed it. Landed it like a boss. Like a boss! <laughs> now watch. I'm going to mess this up. I'm going to back up to try and... <laughs> Get a running distance here. Turn turn our lights on so we can see a little bit. All right, let's get some speed. Get some speed. And release. So you get a lot more speed if you don't. What in the world? <laughs> that did not work out. Oh gosh, I don't want to have to walk all the way back. Oh, that was horrible, coat. What are you doing? Okay, just remember it's at the angle right here, and I'm just gonna go ahead and do a reset. There we go. I'm gonna lose my axes. We'll go grab them. I keep expecting to hear the. But it's not. Uh oh, I'm losing presence here. What happened? Explosions. There we go. All right, let's go pick up our axes, and then uh, we'll go see down in uh, the water cave. I'd like to go explore that as well, because I've never seen it with the filters on before. Like, th that's basically what's going on right now is this is a environment filter and fog. So, um, the physical changes, like the... The no leaves on trees and stuff like that. No, 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 no. Oh, let me through, let me through, let me through, please. Dude, even the blocks are glitching. Wait, how am I supposed to get back if the... Oh, silly code. All right, okay, so we're looking for spook code on this side. <laughs> I 
No spook wood. At all. There are my axes. Big and tall. Oh, oh, come on. No, oh, there. Get it. Is that it? I think that's it, right? Just had two. There we go. Alright, in times X goes over there. Perfect. Alright, can we drive? Oh, oh. There we go. Can we drive back before those rocks all fall? It's been a while since I've seen the, uh, the rocks actually falling. So, I mean, that's, that's pretty cool. And I think there's a way that you're supposed to be able to hit them. So that, like, if you get stuck underneath one... Oh, oh no. Please, sir. Let me go. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm like seriously stuck underneath this avalanche. Come on, shut the door. There you go. Can you get out? What happens if I open this? There we go. Push along. Move along there. Ugh. All right. Well, let's uh, go get a new truck. Excuse me. Oh gosh, they're still they're still falling. The rocks are still falling down. Oh, look out, everyone! Avalanche. Okay, that should be good. I think. Oh, I don't want to walk all the way. Come on, reset the character. Reset, reset. Uh, I've got more things to show you guys, and we're 17 minutes in. Before you know it, like, the entire thing is just going to be me picking up my axes. <laughs> Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Lumber Tycoon 2, where I pick up my axes. That's all we do in this episode. That's it. No, we've got the end times axe, and we've done a couple little things, so... We're, we've still got the update showcase. We're good. I say. Uh, the shrine... The shrine doesn't look any different. There's one, two, and end times X goes over here. There we go. Alright, alright. We are set. Let's go. Now I am going to go ahead and drop off my axes, because, uh, as we all know, there's no way to get back from the water tunnel um, safely. So I'll just drop them off at my axe shop, just on the inside of the door here. By the way, this is not a true axe shop, because I don't sell anything anymore. I used to. <laughs> Skills. <laughs> that was like a bottle flip on the cap of another bottle. Code, what'd you do for your video? I did axe flips. What? Dab. <laughs> okay. Let's go out this direction. Ready? Set. And go. No, 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 no. Let me out. Let me out quickly. No, I'm stuck in the... No! 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 I'm dead. Oof. <laughs> it happens. It's okay. Whew. Good thing I dropped off my axes, huh? Oh, look at the blue wood. I forgot. It looks all purpley. I like the way the glow wood looks. The glowing wood. Where is that? Uh... It's got like a haze to it. It just looks amazing. Alpha or beta axe looks awesome. And yes, I did have this set up so I could try the whole Tic Tac um, memorial with the, the glitch. New. No. Oh, no, 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 no. It's really hard to do. 
Just because, like, it, you don't float in the water anymore. You, like, sink down to the bottom. Alright, we're gonna try this again. At an angle. There we go. Turn into it. There we go. Do, like, this little cartwheel flip-looking thing. Get back some of our health. By the way, I did look up other videos to see if anybody had created um, a way to get to um, the wood. I didn't see anything, guys. Like, I was pretty sure somebody would have came up with something. There are where you can, like, lower the bridge with um, an eyeball. Like, the, the way that I did doesn't require an eyeball. It just requires an oak tree, uh, a big truck, and an axe. Oh, and a saw max too. So yeah, there's a little bit of pre-spending. You do have to spend a little bit of money to like get the long planks and stuff like that. Um, I was also asked the question, is it worth it to sell the um, water tunnel with the Tic Tac wood? No, it's not. Now, if you're selling the wood to other players, yes, I would put a high price on it because, like, supply and demand, you you put a lot of work into getting that wood, so it's definitely worth the money that you're going to sell it to a player. If you take the wood itself and you go just sell it off, it's only worth about $12 per unit, which is really low. That's, like, the lowest. I think it's the cheapest wood in the game. And that was because it was part of the uh, the winter event. So, oh, the music's still down here. That's good. So, this is going to have a really good effect because it's it's glowing because of the the Halloween filter that's on. I'm really excited to see this, by the way. there. I'm just waiting for our health to get back up to the top. By the way, today's video is going to be much more mild and much more calm than normal, just because it's so late, and we did trick-or-treating in the rain, and that was, it was a lot of fun, because we got to go out to uh, some of our friends' house, and we don't get to see them very often just because they live um, out of town, in, an, in another town, actually. Oh, wow. All right, let's go. I should have enough health to get over there. Yeah, I'm good. We're good. Uh, here, I'm gonna turn out the lights. I don't think he would have put any kind of secrets down here. With the exception of the cave, this is probably my other favorite place to visit. I don't think there's anything down here. So let's go ahead and reset. Whew. 
very peaceful. Like, if you ever need time to just go and relax, I would definitely recommend just going down there and hanging out. Anytime you feel stressed or if there's you've had a rough day, go down there. And just sit and listen to the music and relax. And remember that no matter what is stressing you out in your life, take time for yourself. Like, take a moment and just realize how lucky you are. All right, we're going to go show off the... Oh, oh, come on. Yes, it's a deal. It's a, it's a deal, dude. Come on. We've almost hit the 30-minute uh, mark. Uh, I've looked on YouTube, by the way, to uh, try and decipher um, the code that I'm about to show you. Um, haven't found it yet. I've not found the meaning behind it. We've tried deciphering it. I've asked Lumber Chat. Uh, I've also asked the uh, uh, the fan group. I asked my Discord. And so far, nobody was able to give me an answer. There it is. I don't know if I showed that to you guys yet. Maybe I did. Was it at the beginning of the video I showed this? But I've also tried uh, tried a couple of different things. And I'm not sure if this is the same code from last year. I'm going to have to go back and check. If it's the same code, then the video's gone. But if it's not the same code, then it is something new. Okay. Last time, run around here. Let's take a quick peek. Any spook wood. If I do find it, I don't have any axes on me. Oops. You know what? I'll stop and grab an amber axe while I'm over here. And if you're lucky enough to get into a server and it's still the Halloween update, go buy some amber axes and some pumpkins. Make sure you get stocked up before the update ends. Amber axe. Boop. There we go. Drop it. Hi, Bob. <laughs> Hi, Code. I would like to purchase this axe, please. <laughs> Last one I got in stock. No, oh, you heard it here, fans. Last one. So, why did I put it in the back of the truck? I don't. I don't need it in the back of the truck. In fact, what in the world? Did you guys see that? The box was still there. Roblox, your lag. You got lag, bro. Anyhow, I think the lack of music has actually calmed me down as well. So, to everybody in the first video that I recorded, I do want to say um, I'm glad I got to play with you. I'm sorry that things worked out that the way the way they did. But if you're asking, am I mad? No, I am not mad. I'm a little frustrated, but frustration is just a lack of sadness. Or it's a it's a emotion of sadness. So, am I mad? No, I'm not. I'm very calm. I'm relaxed, and I'm glad that the update is finally here. Stay tuned, because it is now November first, which means I start my No Shave November. So, um, if you guys don't know what No Shave November is, it's where I grow my beard out. I no longer shave for the, for the entire month of November. Ooh, the fairy's here. Should we go? Yeah, let's go. Why not? So, for the entire month, I will not shave every single day. I'll let it grow out. And then uh, at the end of the month, I will shave it off, make a single video of me shaving it, and then you guys go and watch that video as much as possible. And for an entire week, however much money that video makes, I take all that money and then I donate it to um, the either St. Jude's or Children's Miracle Network. It's one of the, the children's cancer, uh, cancer foundations, cancer research. So, um, yeah, stay tuned. I'll post that. When do you run next, dude? Five minutes. Well, we don't have time for five minutes, but we do have time for an outro. So... I'll go ahead and purchase my ticket right now. 
Just to get it out of the way. I'll buy a ticket. Thanks, we'll be off soon. <laughs> Thanks. That's good old Hoover. By the way, I got him in a Roblox toy thing the other day. It was awesome. I'm probably going to stay here and hang out while the video uploads and get everything set and ready for tomorrow. Happy Halloween, everyone. I hope you had a great time with candies and the updates and all the spook trees that were found. Um, lots of fun. I had a lot of fun. This was a good month. We're also going to have uh, a new update for um, Thanksgiving. You should be getting cranberry sauce, I think. And then there was um, maybe a new turkey. We don't know what kind, though. So... Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos. I love you guys very much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Wait, didn't I just say that? I think I just said that. Yeah. Happy Halloween. Outro. Thank you.